welcome to edupediaworld.com hi this is somja jenaya in this video we are going to talk about the reproductive health and its significance and different methods taken to achieve that what is reproductive health according to world health organization or who reproductive health means a total well being in all aspects of reproduction that is physical emotional behavioral and social therefore a society with people having physically and functionally normal reproductive organs and normal emotional and behavioral interactions among them in all sex related aspects might be called reproductively healthy population reproductive health problems and strategies india was amongst the first countries in the world to initiate action plans and programs at a national level to attain total reproductive health as a social goal these programs called family planning were initiated in 1951 and were periodically assessed over the past decades improved programs covering wider reproduction related areas are currently in operation under the popular name reproductive and child health care rch programs the reproductive and child health rch programs was launched in october 1997 the main aim of the program is to reduce infant child and maternal mortality rates creating awareness among people about various reproduction related aspects and providing facilities and support for building up a reproductively healthy society are the major tasks under these programs various strategies to create awareness the with the help of audio visual and the print media governmental and non governmental agencies have taken various steps to create awareness among the people about reproduction related aspects parents other close relatives teachers and friends also have a major role in dissemination of the above information introduction of sex education in schools should also be encouraged to provide right information to the young so as to discourage children from believing in myths and having misconceptions about sex related aspects proper information about reproductive organs and adolescence and related changes safe and hygienic sexual practices sexually transmitted diseases std aids etc would help people especially those in adolescent age group to lead a reproductively healthy life educating people especially fertile couples and those in marriageable age group about available birth control options care of pregnant mothers postnatal care of the mother and child importance of breastfeeding equal opportunities for male and the female child etc would address the importance of bringing up socially conscious healthy families of desired size awareness of problems due to uncontrolled population growth social evils like sex abuse and sex related crimes etc needed to be created to enable people to think and take up necessary steps to prevent them and thereby build up a socially responsible and healthy society how various programs implemented by the government improve the reproductive health of the population successful implementation of various action plans to attain reproductive health requires strong infrastructural facilities professional expertise and material support these are essential to provide medical assistance and care to people in reproduction related problems like pregnancy delivery stds abortions contraceptions menstrual problems infertility etc implementation of better techniques and new strategies from time to time are also required to provide more efficient care and assistance to people statutory ban on amniocentesis for sex determination is one of the that this amniocentesis is used to uh, determine the fetal sex based on chromosomal pattern in the amniotic fluid surrounding the developing embryo the other programs are increasing female feticide level checking massive child immunization etc 
indication of reproductive health of the society better awareness about sex related matters increased number of medically assisted deliveries and better postnatal care leading to decreased maternal and infant mortality rates increased number of couples with small families better detection and cure of stds and overall increased medical facilities for all sex related problems etc or are indications of improved reproductive health of the society population explosion and birth control in the last century and all around development in various fields significantly improved the quality of life of the people however increased health facilities along with better living conditions had an explosive impact on the growth of population the world population which was around 2 billion that is 2000 million in 1900 rocketed to about 6 billion by 2000 a similar trend was observed in india too our population which was approximately 350 million at the time of our independence that is in 1947 reached close to the billion mark by 2000 and it grows 1 billion in may 2000 that means every sixth person in the world is an indian a rapid decline in death rate maternal mortality rate mmr and infant mortality rate imr as well as an increase in number of people in reproducible age are probable reason for this the current population of india in 2050 is estimated to be 1.28 billion such an alarming growth rate could lead to an absolute scarcity of even the basic requirements that is food shelter and clothing in spite of all the significant progress made in those area therefore the government was forced to take up uh, serious measures to check this population growth rate. measures taken to tackle the population explosion The most important step to overcome this problem is to motivate smaller families by using various contraceptive methods. You might have seen advertisements in media as well as posters, bills, etc., showing a happy couple with two children with the slogan "Ham do hamare do, we do our do." Many couples, mostly the young, urban working ones, have even adopted and one child no. statutory raising of marriageable age of the female to 18 years and that of males to 21 years and incentives given to couples with small families are two of the other measures taken to tackle this problem in the next video we will be discussing about the commonly used contraceptive methods which help prevent unwanted pregnancies thank you